everybody, Dr. Darok here. Welcome back to Blightfall. This is episode two of my Let's Play of Blightfall, the mod pack slash quest thing. And yeah, it's pretty, pretty interesting so far. Um, we haven't gotten much accomplished, but I did make some basic tinkers uh, construct items and some tinkers tools over here, so that's good. Um, and now I've got coal. So I'm going to take some of this coal and cook some stone up so that I can't... Oh, uh, I should have maybe turned that into regular cobblestone. Shouldn't I have? Oh, well, no problem. I'm just going to let the let everything fall where it may. Can I use that as stone, maybe? It appears to work as stone. For many things, but not everything. So maybe... Okay. Yeah, in the door or dictionary, it is stone. Okay, so I should be able to make that work, I think, right? So three stone and a stick, because I am trying to make a, um, oh, it's getting dark, and I don't think I claimed my bone meal for today. Aha, oh yes. Boom, three days out of three days, I've claimed that free bone meal, and uh, yeah, booyah. So that means, that means they give me enough bone meal to make some things every day. That's pretty useful, actually. I'm pretty happy with the way this is working so far. But, you know, it's a little bit scary being inside. I, I mean, I am just barely separated by this glass uh, dome from all these evil things that are lurking just outside. You see all those purple spots? Those purple spots are concentrated evil. I'm telling you right now. Oh, and I've also got to get myself some food, like, relatively quickly, like, now-ish. So, I'm hoping that I can make this, um, let's see here. Use, uh-huh, shapeless crafting, and I want a mortar and pestle. So, stone, stone, stick. That looks pretty easy, I think. I can manage that. Stone, stone, stick. Aha! Okay. So now I've got a mortar and pestle. Let's make a whole bunch of flour. Right? Ta-da! And I'm gonna make some bread. So take this flour and use it for bread. How do I make bread? Bread, bread, bread. Oh, okay. Well, why don't I just look up bread? Just like that. Not primitive bread. No, I want... Oh! I cook it in a furnace. Well, that works. Okay, sure. Let's do it. Um, put some... I'll just put all the coal in there. Sure, why not? And, uh, yeah. So, I think one of my next goals is going to be to start leveling up this pickaxe, because I'm going to hold on to this pickaxe for quite some time, since I can just repair it and turn it back into, you know, awesome sauce. So, why don't I dig down a little bit further down here? I know it's dark, you probably can't see anything down here, but why don't I go grab some coal, actually, and fix that. Make some torches. Torches. Uh... So, yeah, there's coal and sticks and torches. Ta-da! Wow, I'm so good at the most basic Minecraft things. You would almost think that I've played this game before. You know what? I should bone meal uh, this tree over here. Ta-da! And get some more wood. Oh, hey, wait, I've got a mattock now. That helps a little bit. Not very much, actually, though. <laughs> Ta-da! Now I'm not punching the trees anymore. I am chopping the trees. Yay, me. Okay, so... With that out of the way... What in the world? Okay, so that was weird. I actually... <laughs> funny story. I upgraded to Windows 10 recently. And, uh, what just happened, you probably, you may not have noticed anything if I'm really good with my editing magic, but basically, uh, my Minecraft decided to minimize all of a sudden for no good reason, um, because Cortana thought that I said, hey Cortana, 
and decided that I was trying to do a voice command. So I had to disable voice activa- activation of Cortana just now. And what was I doing? Oh, yeah. I was making a chest and putting things in it. There we go. Uh, day site cobblestone. Isn't there, like, a geologist quest? They're trying to get samples of... No, no, not in there. This one? Day site, day site, day site, day site, day site, day site. Okay, there we go. Manual submit. Ta-da! Okay, so that's good. Um, partially completed, but good. Uh, the scout. Two quests with unclaimed rewards. Info transporter beacons. Okay. Uh-oh. Oh, come on. That's a crappy place for that. Uh, stupid thing. That thing is going to grow bigger and it's going to turn into spiders. I don't like spiders. Uh, and it makes a horrible, awful noise, too. Okay, so I've got torches. I've got my tools. I think I'm ready to travel underground. Uh, but first, I want to give them some of this bread. I want to eat some of it for myself. So, um, there is... Uh, let's see, how's it go? Eaten twice in the last 250 hunger. Okay, well, that's configured. Then... So there's, as you can see, uh, the more I eat of this bread, the less effective it gets. Oh, shut up, phone. I don't want to hear it right now. Okay, there we go. And you can also see that I've got this well-fed, um, well-fed, uh, buff right now. Can I pop this thing by getting close to it? Normally, if you get close to those, they just explode into spiders, which everybody loves spiders. Of course. Uh -huh. So, with this bread, I will send some back. Uh, wait, wait. Register as Team Alpha. Welcome to Team Alpha. You've automatically been registered. Thank you. Okay. Yay! That's awesome. That works. Learning to scout. It's a hostile, dangerous world out there, and I intend to send you to the far reaches of it. So, basically, he says go to 859-66-942. Which is 8.59. Somewhere? Wait, wait, wait. What was it? 8.59.942. And then he says... Try using that method to navigate to the section of your base I specify on the right... Visited. Okay, cool. Then, send me the dirt block underneath it. Oh, okay. So, let's do this, then. Okay. And then, submit. Awesome. Claim reward. So now, I've unlocked Travel to Swamp. That sounds interesting. There's a swamp in the mid-southwest of the continent. It might have sugar cane you can use for some of Dr. Sprouse's task. Contains an easily obtained alien metal that can mine gold and bitumen you can craft into rubber. For some teams, this will be an easy trip. For others, it'll be a bit of a hike. Bring a boat. It'll probably help. Okay. Okay. Sure. That sounds like... That, sound, that doesn't sound too hard, I guess. Um, oh, hey. Another sapling. Booyah! Um, I should be able to get different types of wood saplings, I think. Um, let me go back and back again. I know I want to go mining real quick, but or soon, anyways. But let's see. Request food. Request seeds. Request mob. Give you some seeds from our agricultural arc. Again, the contents are jumbled. Most of the seeds you could probably get from using bone meal on grass and breaking the tall grass. Okay. Potatoes, carrots, melons, and pumpkins. I kind of want some of that. Mission Outlook minus two. Okay, I'll, I'll request some seeds. That sounds good. Request mob. Animals. Uh, maybe later. I'm not quite ready to start a farm yet for animals. Sapling. Brought a supply of saplings. Things got a little bit mixed up in space, and we didn't label them. 
I can guarantee there's a tree in here, but beyond that, I honestly don't know what you'll get. Okay. So, let's try that, too. Okay, so I've got some bags to open up. Seed bag, sapling bag. Seed bag. Aluminum or berry bush. What? Really? Really? Well, okay. That's, I like that. I like the way, I like the way that, that worked. That worked out for me pretty well. Sapling bag. Blood sapling and nether rack. Okay. Well, I don't think I can grow that in here very well. Um, I have this feeling like that'd be a bad idea. Ah! Wah! Okay, that, that legitimately surprised me. I wasn't expecting it to work this time, because it wouldn't blow up last time I moved next to it. Ha ha! I'm in a dome! You can't get me! Ha ha ha! Uh, how am I ever going to get to that swamp? Man. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Swamp, right? Uh, I want to set that... Uh, blah, blah. Scout. Go to swamp. And I want to actually put a waypoint there. So, 592, 1000, and 63. Hit... B. Okay. Five, nine, two, one thousand, and sixty-three. Um, swamp. Whoops. Oh, okay, good. All right. So, uh, spiders. Yay. Hey, why don't you come over here and fall off? Take some fall damage. Fall to your death or something. Can you do that? Yikes. Wow. I do not like those spiders. They're just annoying. They make the most annoying sounds, and oh, no. Oh, that tree has fully decayed into purple stuff, so I guess I'm not getting any, getting any good wood out of that guy. What about that tree? I can't even see the bottom of that tree for some reason. I'm not certain why. But whatever. That's okay. That is all perfectly fine. And, uh, I'll survive. I'll survive. I will survive! Hey, hey, hey! Okay, I can stop that right now. I should never do that again. Uh, put my torches down. And dig. Dig and dig and dig. Dig, 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 dig deeper. Yes. Okay, so hopefully I'm gonna find some useful materials here that um, will help me progress uh, because really uh, oh hello Sirtis Quartz so what your discovery of Sirtis Quartz has unlocked more info in the material books okay S discovery of a soft metal material is it really a soft metal material okay oh boy it kind of bothers me that I just dug underneath of myself, actually, believe it or not. Uh, what is this? Red granite iron ore. Okay, so that's cool. Also, um, I wonder what I can do with that. Oh, I can't mine it yet. As it said, it's soft metal mining level, and this only has a mining level of hard non-metal. So, uh, what about... Didn't I mine two sort of quartz things? Where did the rest of my Sirtis Quartz go? Or am I crazy? No, I swear I mined two Sirtis Quartz things. Didn't I? Comatite. Well, I guess maybe I'm crazy. Uh, either way. Mm. See, now that bothers me. I'm, I'm really bothered right now. I swear... I, like, I swear on my life that I mined two Sirtis Quartz. I'll find out whenever I watch the video back. I don't know what happened to him. Where's the other Sirtis Quartz? I don't see anything else in here that I mined. Nothing special or unique. Coal? No, I had that on me. Um, okay, well, maybe I'm crazy. I really thought I mined, like, two blocks deep worth of Sirtis Quartz. So I'm pretty confused. Okay. But either way, I should be able to find out the... Ah! I don't want to hear you, spiders! Stop! Just stop! 
I'll have to fix that later so that I can hear things that are attacking me. But right now, I'm safe in my dome. What the hell do I need to hear these spiders for? Ugh, freaking annoying. Terrible. Terrible. Okay, so Surtis Quartz has a mining level of soft metal. So once I get this Surtis Quartz, I can mine iron. Um, however, I do have a slight issue with that. Because you can only upgrade... You can only upgrade your tools whenever they're fully repaired, right? So once I start using this Surtis Quartz pickaxe, right, I will no longer be able to up, up, the upgrade it, right? Like, so if I made, say, an iron pick head or something like that, I wouldn't be able to upgrade that until I got to the... until I found some Surtis Quartz again. Or I would have to make a new pickaxe the other way. Um, so right now I'm really bothered about this. Red granite salt. Oh, okay. That's probably what I mined that I thought was also... Hello, infuscolium. That is a soft metal and I can't yet mine it. But let's put this gravel here so I remember exactly where to look for that. Because that's kind of cool. Um, I'm going to dig this out. See if maybe there's another Surtis Quartz nearby. Right here-ish. Please, Surtis Quartz. I want, I want your babies, Surtis Quartz. Give me... Yeah! Great. More salt. Yay. Wow. Guess it's giving me experience levels and things, so that's kind of cool. Um, well, okay. I think I've hit a little bit of a snag here, but that's okay. I am going to go ahead and upgrade to a Surtis Quartz pickaxe. Um, but I think I'm going to leave my flint pickaxe as is, um, and make a new pickaxe out of Surtis Quartz. So, let's go ahead and make a Surtis Quartz pickaxe head, and, um, nether rack. Okay, so I think I'm going to make my handle out of wood, probably, right? Yes, wood handles. I think I can just use a stick. Um, so, and what else? Uh, I also want a tool binding, which I want to make out of stone. There we go. Stone tool binding. Yay, everybody's happy, right? So, put my stick in the thing and stone binding and quartzy, and I'm going to name this pickaxe quartzy. Hello, quartzy! <laughs> So Quartzy is now my special pickaxe for mining things that uh, I can't mine with the other pickaxe since I can't yet um, upgrade Quartzy. Uh, I'm thinking, oh, hey, is it day four right now? Can I go back and claim some more bone meal? Yes, I can. Ha ha. Okay, perfect. So, <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm such a goofball. And I think... I hope that if you're here watching my videos, you like that, because that's just who I am all the time. So if you don't like that, I'm sorry. I really am. But I'm a goofball. Uh, so, yeah. Here comes some more iron. Yes. And, oh, hey, look. There's sand. Sand here. I'm going to need that so that I can create grout. What is this? Sandstone. Sure. Ta-da! More sand! More sand than you can fit in your hand. Or something. I don't know. That's not a very good slogan, I guess. Maybe if I was a beach, that would be a good slogan. Coma tight. Eh. Gravel, gravelly gravel, mining gravel. I know, I'm probably boring the heck out of you. I might I might even edit this out, but I'm really not sure. Tell you what, I'm going to continue mining. Um, I think, for now, I'm going to go ahead and call an end to this episode. On the next episode, I think we're going to travel to the swamp and see what lies there waiting for us. And, uh, yeah. So thanks, everybody, for watching. Uh, I will see you next time on my special space adventure here in uh, Blightfall. Yeah, that's what it's called, Blightfall. 
So thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time, and uh, keep it fresh. Oh, yeah, and while you're at it, uh, make sure to hit the like button down there on this video, and we'll see if uh, we'll see if anybody likes it. So yeah, if you liked this video, if you actually watched it, maybe to like to the end or something, please hit that thumbs up. It really gives me a lot of reasons to continue to do this. Uh, if no one likes it, I'm gonna stop. I I have people that really liked my previous let's plays, and they keep asking me when's your let's play coming back, and I'm just like, no one liked it. No one. No one did anything, like, no one gave me likes, no one shared it with their friends, I mean, only the people who really liked it. I, I mean, I need a little bit more than that, you guys, you know what I'm saying? If no one likes it, I'm gonna stop. That's just the way it works. Am I, you know, I should probably make sure that I turn around, because I don't want to dig into tainted areas. Oh well, either way, I'm gonna end this episode here. Um, share it with your friends and hit that like button. That's all. That's all you need to do. You don't even need to leave a, com leave a comment. You can if you want. I sure like them. But, you know, most important thing is you share with your friends so that I can get some views because the more views something has, the more likely I am to do videos like that in the future. You know what I'm saying? So, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time.